Hello today and we're going to have a game of Nigel Mansell's World Championship for the Commodore Amiga. This was a game that came out to celebrate Nigel Mansell's World Championship back in 1992 when he won the Formula 1 World Championship. And I brought it back, I think it's late 92, early 93 I bought this. Can't remember when it came out. Yeah, it was, what are we going to see? wasn't the greatest of right racing games um, no way as good I mean the best Formula 1 game on the Amiga was Formula 1 Grand Prix bar miles and that would always be the best racing game I've ever played so we're going to do a single race um, a little bit of track we've got plenty of countries to choose from how do we do it? hang on Oh, we've got one. Here we go. So we're going to go to Silverstone in Great Britain. Just going to go to race circuit. We ain't going to ponce about with setup or anything like that. Just can't be bothered. Just you're going to see. This wasn't a great racing game. It's more arcadish to me. I mean, the graphics looks arcadish. You look at it, it reminds me a little bit of Grim, which I thought was a good game. Very, I think it was better than this. I don't know, this just. This was all right, but. I don't know, I just didn't really like the driving of it. I don't think it, it's, it doesn't represent the tracks properly. Not like driving on the real tracks, just. You know, very old issue. Fuck up. I mean, the car, other car graphics look quite nice, I admit. Oh dear. Like your animation of the hands when he's going around the corners. Pretty good. Yeah, I only played this on the Amiga. I know this was out on the Abstract CPC, but by that time I. I wasn't playing games on the Amstrad CPC or, or even the Commodore 64 back then. I mean, the Amiga was the computer I had back then. Well, I'd, I had all three back then, but I wasn't even touching the other computers. Once you were on the Amiga, you don't, you don't really look back. But nowadays I do, so I'm playing on the like, Commodore 64, Amstrad, Amiga games. It's nice to play these old games again. A lot of fun. Uh, I'm talking away, I'll keep crashing, I know. I cannot do a very good job of playing this game, which I don't really <laughs> on, my, on my games, to be honest with you. Way out of practice. Anyway, this is good. Where are we? Let's have a look. Well, we're in second place out of 12. On the second lap of three. It's taking these corners way too fast. Car ain't gripping. I actually thought the Williams Renault was a, the best car. It gripped anyway. Had its active suspension, all its, all its things that, you know, sophist was the sophisticated car back, back in that day. Not as I say, Nigel Mansell won the championship quite easy. Very good racing driver, I thought. Uh, God. You wouldn't be very proud of me if, I, if you saw this. <laughs> sake. Here we go around the corner as we're fucking it up totally. Down the straight as we start our last lap. Here we go, so we're in third place. Can we get better than third I wonder? Oh! Bloody hell, not if I want to keep driving in the back of cars I won't. So I think that's um, Second place there, looks like a McLaren. The old McLaren Honda with the old Marlboro livery. I'm just assuming. <laughs> or is it a Ferrari? I saw a bit of white, so it must be a McLaren. You can see it in Senna's McLaren. For fuck's sake. Come on. Go down here. Oh, I'm going off the road again. Oh, we overtook him. Come on. Oh, shit. 
overtaken me again. Come on, you can't settle for third. Oh, yes, here we go. Oh, fucking goodness, just come at you. There we go. Can we get it? No, he's accelerating away. Bastard. Anyway, then what? Andrea de Chichesaris? Fucking hell, did he win the race? Is he used this bastard? Right, as we conclude the review here. Till next time, thank you for watching and goodbye.